Hey ladies, welcome back for part two of how to find the best jeans for your body type slash Walmart jean haul because Walmart has so many affordable and amazing quality jeans right now. They have really stepped up their game. I feel like hashtag Walmart fashion is, is it's a trend. And so of course I hopped on that trend because one, I like jeans and two, I like to save money on the jeans that I buy. So I went to Walmart, or actually rather walmart.com, which I actually created an entire shopping guide for how to shop and find cute clothes on Walmart's website and through the app, which I will link down in the description below. And I found a ton of really cute, really affordable, really amazing quality jeans. And so since I figured I already wanted to share kind of how to find the right denim jeans for your body type, that I would just kind of tie everything in with this Walmart jean haul. Part one has a ton of amazing information in it. If you haven't watched it already, I will link it up here so that you can go back and watch it. And if you love Walmart and you love styling tips and outfit ideas, then go ahead and hit the subscribe button and tap the bell so that you are notified when my new videos with all of those things come out. And if my two to three videos a week isn't enough for you, you can come hang out with me on Instagram where I share more style tips, outfit ideas, day-to-day -day life, behind the scenes sort of things in my Instagram stories pretty much all day, every day. Okay. The first outfit for my Walmart jean haul. I know y'all are just as excited about this as I am. The top is just a long sleeve ribbed top. I love this for layering, or you can wear it by itself just as I am right now. My Amazon leopard belt, this one's always a huge hit anytime I share it. And my favorite skinny jeans from Walmart. Y'all, these are only $20 and the quality is so good. Literally so good. They are a light wash. They have a high rise to them. I love the button up high rise. Actually, I feel like that's just a really fun detail. And as you can see, the skinny jeans are pretty much fitted all the way from the top of my waist down to my ankle, which is typically where skinny jeans land right at the ankle. I love the distressing on them, but honestly, the quality is what gets me. For $20, these, these jeans feel like something that I would buy at Macy's or at Nordstrom's, and they're a fraction of the cost. And my leopard slide-on sandals, I don't even know if these are still in stock anymore because they've been selling so many of them, but these are my go-to sandals lately just because I can slip them on. They're leopard print, which I love, and they're just super comfortable. Okay, so back to the skinny jeans. Like I said, they are a fitted jean and they are essentially great for any body type. Skinny jeans do not discriminate. I will say that some girls who are more curvy prefer not to wear skinny jeans just because they feel like it accents the curves too much and that's maybe something that they're conscious or aware of. If you are someone who is curvier and you feel like skinny jeans highlight or accent the curves and you don't want them to, there is a tip and you can always balance that look out with either a longer top or a more flowy top. And that will just kind of create some sort of balance in your outfit and kind of hit down below your hips or where your curves are to not highlight or accent them. There are a few shoe options that are great for skinny jeans and those are either tucked into booties or boots or you can wear them with sandals, heeled sandals, flat sandals, platform sandals, or heels. So you've got quite a variety of shoe options which gives you a lot of room for outfit options and ideas with skinny jeans. So you can dress them up with heels, you can dress them down with sneakers, there's lots of variations and lots of options that you can do with skinny jeans. Okay, the next type of jeans that we're going to cover are straight leg jeans. And these are another jean that are great for anyone. They have a little bit more of a relaxed fit to them than the skinny jeans. They don't taper off at the bottom. It's pretty much just a straight leg the entire way down. And the girlfriend jeans and boyfriend jeans and mom jeans and things like that that are really in style right now, those all fall under the straight leg style. Like I said, the straight leg jeans are another style that look amazing on almost everyone, 
but they come in especially handy if you are a little bit more top heavy because they do have that straight leg. They tend to balance out your body really well if you are heavier on the top or have more of an inverted triangle type shape. A little tip for straight leg pants is they always look better rolled or cuffed at the bottom. So no matter what kind of shoe you're wearing it with, and they do pretty much go with any shoe out there, it does not matter, but rolling them or cuffing them at the bottom always gives not only like really good detail, but it also just makes the pants look better on. Okay, so for my straight leg jean outfit, I just have on this rib top. This is just a short sleeve version of the same top that I was wearing in the last outfit. And honestly, I'm just going to wear one or the other of these shirts because I really don't wanna highlight the shirts of the outfit. My focus is on the jeans from Walmart in this video. So I'm really not worried about trying to find other tops to pair it with. All right, so the jeans that I have for my straight leg outfit are these boyfriend jeans. They're a time and true brand. And I love the distress that they have to them. I love anything with distressing, but that is a personal preference. Everyone is different when it comes to that. They are more of a mid-rise, so they hit right below my belly button. So these actually come in four different wash colors. They have the white, and then they also have three different other light, medium, and dark options, which I really like. But since I had so many medium and dark options that I'm going to be sharing with you, I wanted to get these in white. Plus, I absolutely love white denim for spring and summer. So these have a really good fit to them. They are a little bit more fitted up here, but as you can see at the bottom, the pant leg just goes straight. And then I also have them rolled at the end, which you can see just to give it a little bit more detail. And because like I mentioned, the straight pants always look better rolled. And then these are just my espadrille platforms that I've shared a ton on all of my Walmart hauls. They're so comfortable. They've got elastic bands around them and just like a really comfortable formed footbed to them. So they're super, super comfortable. Boot cut jeans are another great style. They are another one that are a little bit more form fitting. So they are a little bit tighter on the top and then they flare out just a little bit down past the knee. Boot cut jeans are amazing on all body styles, but I will say this. They look incredible on women who are curvy and women who have shorter legs because they balance out the curves and they also create a slimming look and an elongating look. So if you have shorter legs, they kind of help to elongate them a little bit. And if you are curvier, the small flare at the bottom kind of helps balance out those curves. These are a great jean for you to dress up with, whether you're going to a country concert, you wanna throw on your cowgirl boots and your cowgirl hat, or you wanna throw on a cute pair of booties and maybe a cami tank top to go hang out with your girlfriends. These are a great jean to do it with. For this boot cut look, I still have on the same ripped shirt, but don't look too closely because I actually just spilt my tea on it, so there's a stain. <laughs> little fun fact about me. I drank a lot of tea, but these are a great dark, I would say medium to dark wash boot cut jean. They are from Walmart. None of these jeans are over $25. So they're all very affordable. They do have a really good stretch to them. They are mid-rise. They hit right below the belly button. And as you can see, they look absolutely amazing with booties. You can also pair these with heels. That's another option, but ideally boot cut jeans, as the name says, go with boots or booties. I don't think this is a style that can go out of style. I feel like it's just a really timeless jean to have. Is anyone else as excited as I am that flares are back in style? Because I am totally here for it. I've shared these flares on one of my other Walmart hauls and I am still wearing them because I love all things 90s and flares just remind me so much of the 90s and it makes me super happy. So flares are an amazing jean to have when they are in style. They are something that obviously comes and goes. It's like every 20 years, they were here in the 70s, they were here in the 90s, and then now here we are again in 2020 and they are back in style. Flares typically have a more fitted feel to them at the top around the waist and around your legs, and then they flare off below the knee even more so than the boot cut jeans do. And actually have a lot of the same slimming effects, they have the same elongating effects, and look amazing on curvier girls with curvier hips. 
as the boot cut, but only that is magnified times like 10 because of the flare. So they actually help a little bit more with those things. So if that's something that you're trying to balance out, that's definitely something to take into consideration. And as crazy as it sounds, because they do help the girls with the curvier hips balance out their look, they're also very flattering on girls with narrow hips as well, because it kind of takes the attention away from the narrow hips and takes the attention to the bottom of the pant where the flare actually is. So that's also another option as well. If you are someone with a thinner body type and maybe narrower hips, that's also a great option for you. Now, I love pairing flares with dressier shoes. I feel like they're just a more funky style, so I like wearing them with heels, booties, platforms, or things like that. Something with a heel, ideally, because flares don't really look good paired with flat shoes like sneakers or flat sandals or anything like that. Because they do have the elongating effect, you probably want to buy them a little bit longer and then pair them with a little bit higher of a shoe than you would normally wear. Still the same old white top, but I put on my flares and I love them. Like I mentioned, I've shared them in another Walmart haul, but I'm sharing them here again because they are back in style and I think these flares are absolutely amazing. They have a great amount of stretch to them. They are mid-rise, although you probably could pull them up a little bit and make them high-rise if you wanted to. And they're dark wash, they're very comfortable. These are actually um, by Sofia Vergara and I just love her jeans. I feel like she just makes really amazing jeans. So it's a really great brand to buy from if you're shopping from Walmart for jeans. And like I mentioned, when I was talking about the flares, I have them paired with my platform wedges. I think anything with a heel or a wedge is going to be great for flares just to kind of help elevate that elongating sense that it gives off for the legs. Even if you are a tall girl, do not hesitate wearing flares because they're still super flattering. You just want to make sure that you balance it out with your top. So if you have longer legs and you are tall, maybe leave your shirt untucked to kind of create that balance between torso and leg length. Wide leg jeans are another fun and funky style of jeans. And I love that they are actually in style right now. Before this, I had never worn wide leg pants before, but I'm really, really digging them. So these are great, again, for all body types. And I say this throughout the entire video, but honestly, any jean can be great for your body type. It just depends on what you wear it with and how you accessorize with it. So that is the most important thing. And that's why I've been implementing these different tips and ideas on what you can wear with it to kind of make it work for your body type. But even though wide leg jeans are great for all body types, they are especially great for those girls with the long legs. Since they are only fitted at the top and then they're essentially a wide leg all the way from the hip down, they create a shorting effect. So they're basically doing the exact opposite of what the flares are doing, where the flares elongate the look of your legs, wide legs are actually shortening it. So if you're someone with longer legs, this is a great way to kind of create the balance between the legs and the torso again. And they're super fun. There's so many ways that you can wear them. You can dress them up with heels. You can dress them down with sneakers, which is what I've got paired right now, as you will see here in a minute. And they're just a really fun style to try. Okay, the last outfit that we have is just the same rib shirt. You got my doggy in the background. He wanted to hop in the video. He likes to make his debut from time to time. And I have on these fun wide leg pants. And I, I have to say, I absolutely love the belt. I feel like this is just like so funky, so retro. I love it. And as you can see, they are fitted right around the hips and the waist, but then immediately they go into sort of this wide leg. These hit right at the ankle, so they're super fun. They would be very flattering with a sandal or a heel, like something very summery or springy, I feel like. But I have them paired with these platform sneakers that I've shared with you so many times in my past Walmart hauls and hauls in general, just because I love basically that all things 90s is coming back in style. And these are very comfortable. They have the memory foam footbed to them. And I just, I love that they're plain white and that they just go with so much. 
And I just want to say thank you again for watching this video. I hope that you got some really good information and better understanding of why jeans fit the way that they do and which jeans you can totally rock and what you can rock them with. And if you haven't already, go check out part one of this video because there are a ton of really good tips in there when it comes to buying the, that perfect pair of jeans.